How's it going everyone? So in this video, we will be doing a push-up workout. Uh, before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already. I do appreciate the support. It helps my channel grow. Also, please follow me on Instagram at DylanBerg999. Um, so the exercise that we're going to be doing today is going to be reversed, reverse wrist push-ups. So instead of doing push-ups like this, we're going to do them like this, reverse wrist much, much harder variation to do than the normal push-up. So instead of doing five reps, we're going to keep it at three reps. Again, quality over quantity. And still, we're going to be doing 10 sets. So that's going to give us a solid 30 repetitions. If three reps is um, not enough for you, you can go ahead and bump it up to five. But trust me, doing these, doing 50 to 100 reps um, is going to be very tough. So that's why I'm keeping it at 30 total repetitions. Let's get started. So to do this, again, this is a normal push-up, just like this. We're going like this. So reverse wrist, and then we just go like one, two, three. Again, I could probably do, don't get me wrong, I could do one, I know how many I can do because I've done these before for quite a few reps, but I could do 10 reps, I could do 10 sets, I could get a total of 100 repetitions in, but the average person cannot do that, so I'm not gonna do that, because again, my workouts are based for the average person. I want the average person to be able to complete these workouts and have a really good workout. This is my first video of the day. I always say in my videos, the first video of the day is the hardest video to do. It is the hardest video to do, if you're lacking a little bit of motivation. Let's get started. Another set. So again, just like this. Five. Two. Three. This is a little bit hard on your wrists. So if your wrists are um, prone to injury, they're a little bit sore, you may not want to do this exercise, but for most people, it should be okay. But yeah, first video of the day. Once I get past this video, it seems like the next eight or nine videos are just that much easier. I don't know why. Starting to make videos at quarter to seven, 6.45 right now. Um, got home at a decent time. Um, went for a shower, had some food, and then we went, we had some personal things that we went to do, me and the wife, and we went to get some food at the grocery store, and yeah, that pretty well eats up a lot of time. So, go like this. One, two, three. Just like that. So yeah, 6.45, probably gonna go for a drive with my wife tonight for about an hour relaxing for us, go for drives. Um, just driving around anywhere, look at the scenery, stuff like that. It's relaxing to me, that's something I do to relax. Get a coffee and just chill. So um, gonna do that for an hour. So I think I'd like to get nine videos today. Nine videos would be sweet. It is a Friday. I don't know when this video is being posted, I think February 2nd, but today I'm making it on January 3rd. So this is a Friday. So I got all night, uh, don't go to work tomorrow. So I'd like to get nine videos in. That would be, that would be sweet. Again, I don't know why this looks weird when I do this, but this, this kind of looks weird when I do this. Okay. One, two, three. Again, this is a much, much harder variation to do than the regular push-up but I wanna show you guys it because it just gives you another tool to use when you're doing your push-ups. But yeah, I'd like to make nine videos today. Nine videos takes me around three hours to do. That's, um, that's kind of the average time it, may, it takes for me to do that. Stuff has been going on at work, really been stressing me out lately. Um, we're waiting on something to happen, so I'm not gonna get too personal with it but um, it could really affect a lot of things. So, um, not, I've been super 
duper stressed out lately. We should know in the next week or two what's going down. And yeah, just been extremely stressed out. I was stressed out prior, a month prior to this. I was stressed out all month due to the new changes with YouTube and stuff like that. So I was stressed out about that and I was stressed out about my job. So last two months are gonna be really, really rough. But that's okay, we just push forward, we move forward. When something happens that's negative, we try to, we just do our best to try to move on and try to fix it and just keep pushing on my friends. Let's do another, uh, another three, three repetitions. One, two, three. But yeah, from doing this, my wrists are pretty sore, I'm not gonna lie. Um, just comes with the exercise. Again, it is a tough exercise if you have wrist problems, so you may want to avoid it if that's happening. <sighs> but yeah. Been very stressed out lately. YouTube has kind of calmed me down. It's made me, I don't know, just making videos calms me down and it gets me into a nice place comfortable place and yeah um i got a lot going on right now you guys a lot i do i do i work eight to ten hours per day i then do schooling and i do youtube so i got a lot going on But yeah, again, I wish I never took the medical transcription course. That's the course that I'm doing right now. I've done it for six months, I'll do it for another six months. I just wish I had not done that. Um, just because, um, just because um, I don't think I will do it as a job because it is way, way too meticulous. Um, even doing the training right now, like, I'm doing okay, but I'm still making a ton of errors. And when you get a real, when you get a real job for doing this, you can't make as many errors as I'm making. So I know I'm still learning. I'm still going to school for it, but it is tough to say the least. Let's do another three, one, two, three. Killing it, you guys. I'm sweating pretty good right now. After this, got a pelvic floor video to make and then an ab video to make. And then my three videos after that, I got a hickey, a hand grip, and a vein video. Those three are super easy. They're only five minute videos. And the hickey video is only three minutes usually. So those three videos will go by very quickly. I just have to get through the pelvic floor and the ab video. So yeah, I like doing uh, pelvic floor exercises. They're pretty fun to do and a lot of my subscribers love them. So it's great, great to do. Let's do another, another three. One, two, three. Woo! Okay, I'm sweating pretty good right now. Um, wrists aren't too bad. A little bit sore because again, we're putting, we're putting them in that position. And um, again, if you have any wrist problems, maybe avoid this exercise. Um, what I found when doing this exercise is there's, a, you have to find the right placement, the hand grip placement. If you go too narrow, it's just super weird and it doesn't really, um, it doesn't really work. If you go too wide, it doesn't work. You have to kind of find your hand placement, your own hand placement, and then the exercise will seem a lot easier. That's what I noticed anyways. Um, end of video. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, please subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already. I do appreciate the support. It helps my channel grow. Also, please follow me on Instagram 
at Dillenberg 999. Thanks, guys.